Hey, it's Tisha with Tisha Marie Enterprises and the Gals Inspiration Hub. Hope you're doing well this Thursday. So I went to our Social Connect Happy Hour on Monday and one of the guests that came said something to me that has got me thinking and it probably has you thinking too, especially if you are like me or like many of us trying to juggle this whole work-life balance deal and one thing that um, that he said is he kind of compared it to his daughter who was playing sports and said I don't deal well with when my daughter plays and she puts in lazy effort but I commend her and I celebrate her when she puts in her best effort and it got me thinking it's actually had me thinking a lot this week and um, I know why I'm doing these video blogs and and doing a little bit more of a weekly reflection of, hey, that's a good thought. I wonder how, ever, how many other people are thinking that exact same thing. And, um, and I just started to think, have I been putting in my best effort all of these years? Or have I been being lazy? <laughs> and how many of us feel that way? How many of us start to get too hard on ourselves and say, I should have done this. I could have done this more. I should have reached this goal right here. And, and then we just beat ourselves up. That guilt sets in. Are we a good mother? Are we building our business to where we think it should be? Um, but you know what? I look at that and I say, you know what? I have put in the best effort that I possibly could give it in the time that I had without denying myself of the priorities and that I also want to weave into my daily life, which includes my kids and being there for every single moment. So have I taken all the clients that I could? Have I built my business? Have I made six figures yet? No, <laughs> of course not. But at the same time, I wouldn't trade it because I put in the best effort that I could possibly give it. And as chapters open in your life, you're gonna be able to ebb and flow with what's coming. Like, I'm pretty excited. My daughter Ellie is um, in preschool now and is getting ready to go into early entrance kindergarten, crossing her fingers at least which really does free up more time for me. And in the next in the next year, no more hauling stuff to my parents' house and working out of their bedroom and, and or their living room table. Now I, I finally get to have a more structured schedule, which, allow me, which will allow me to go further, do more, while still being able to be there with the kiddos. So anyway, just my rant, just my rave, my, uh, my little vent session. But like I said, if you're feeling like you haven't put in that best effort think again what in your life has really changed over the last three years five years ten years and then don't beat yourself up remember to celebrate all of those little successes along the way not just the big ones and and know that you've put in the best effort you possibly could we're not lazy ladies trust me we're not lazy all right till the next weekly reflection i'll talk to you soon